Welcome to room 201. This used to be our pre upper preschool room. This year, it's going to be our four large group room for kindergarten through third grade. Let's step inside and see what kind of differences we're making in this room. Obviously, these tables won't be here on a Sunday morning, but... Oh, look! Here's Jen to explain third kindergarten through third grade large group is going to be different this year. Hi, good morning, guys. I hope you're all doing well. Welcome to large group. As you can see, we're in a different location as well as quite a different classroom. We are going to be located in 201 for our large group this year. Now, large group is going to be a little different than you were used to last year. Large group is going to start with the second and third graders in this classroom at the beginning of their Sunday school time. The kindergarten and first graders are going to be in their classroom earlier, doing their class time first. And about 25 to 30 minutes in, we will swap roles and the kindergarten first grade will be coming in here and the second and third graders will be leaving to go enjoy their class time with Holy Moly. As you can see, we have decorated and made it more energetic. We're excited for lots of fun in large group, a lot of different activities, a lot of different music and jumping around and we're hoping to just have so much fun in this room celebrating all that we can with our Lord and Savior Jesus. So I hope you're as excited as I am and we will see you in a couple weeks. Good morning and welcome to your Spark Kids classroom. We are entering room 204, which is where the kindergarten class will be held. And normally we will have children's tables set up, four tables with eight kids' chairs all around them in the classroom. And let's come on in and check out where our supplies will be. All the supplies that you will need in the classroom will always be in this cabinet. So whether you are a lead teacher or a small group table leader, everything you will need is in this cabinet. All your spark Bibles for your kids to share at the tables. We have crayons, markers, scissors, glue sticks, and of course any extra supplies that will be needed will also be found in here. As you see, we will have two binders that are in this classroom all the time for lead teachers. It will include all the lessons. Inside you'll have a table of contents so you'll know which pages and where to go. There will be a calendar of all the lessons, a checklist to go through each day with your kids, uh, with the attendance and making sure everything is cleaned up and put away. All the lessons will be included in this binder with a step-by-step -step, step -step process. For a table assistant, you will have a binder as well, looking pretty similar to the one that the lead teacher will have. If there are any questions, please, I would love to talk to you in person and go over any of these details more in depth. What the first graders will be doing. Welcome. We are just down the hall from the room you just saw. This is 203. This is where the first grade Spark Kids will be located. Let's venture in and see the changes in this room. As you can see, the room is not set for the Sunday school. We will have four tables in this classroom as well with uh, all uh, Sunday school sized chairs. Let's venture over on our left over to the cabinets where all your school supplies. Sunday school supplies will be. As you can see, we have labeled all these cabinets so that way you will know what is located in them. Let's open them up. In this one, you will see just as next door, all the supplies that you will need will be in this cabinet. For Spark Kids, all your Spark Bibles are located in this cabinet here for all those first graders. And the cabinet just aside, well as the teacher binders. All of these binders are exactly the same for both Spark and Holy Moly. As you'll see, the green is going to be for the Spark teacher.
teachers and assistants. And then the purple will be for the holy moly teachers and table assistants. I hope you found this video very informative. If you have any questions regarding anything you saw today or that wasn't mentioned, please just get a hold of me and I'd love to talk to you. See you real soon. Thank you.